welcome back to my channel i am here with a review i finally got my hands on the subway foot long auntie ann's pretzel if you have not seen my video where i review the foot long cookie and the foot long churro in that video i stated when i went to go pick up those items they were out of the foot long pretzel and that I will go back and do a review. But before I get into this review, if you're new here, I just ask that you hit that subscribe button below. Hit that bell to be notified when we drop one video. That's once a week, every Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. All right, so this is the Subway Foot Long Pretzel. And up on the board, it showed the pretzel and a side of either mustard or cheese which i got neither i don't know maybe they were out or maybe she just forgot but it's okay the main thing is how does this pretzel taste and i have high hopes because the pretzel is a auntie ann's pretzels now this is going to run you three dollars for the foot long which is not bad out and here is the foot long you have salt um on the picture there was a lot more salt there is some on the other side it is a golden brown it is not hot um and i don't live far from the subway but i feel like the cookie the foot long cookie i got in the churro stay hot um they did warm this up in the microwave as far as the softness it's a little soft you can see that when i press on it like i said it's nice golden brown let's go ahead and taste this That is the center. Okay, so it has, it does have that Auntie Anne's taste. I won't say a full on taste, <clears throat> this is more like the little cousin or the niece and nephew. Because it's not, because Auntie Anne's got that buttery taste to it. And this really, I mean, you can see a little butter on there. But it's not like the Auntie Anne pretzel that you normally get. I will say the first bite was really tough. And I don't know, maybe because it's the, the ends of it. So let me try again. Yeah, the bottom is really tough, but when you try to bite into it, you try to break it off, because the bottom is so tough, it, it makes it hard. Now the top is soft, the top is soft. I think they could have did a little better. It could have been done a little, a little better. I would definitely have to eat the top instead of eating the bottom. Mm. Yeah, they could have did a little better. I can see where they were going, but this doesn't. Tastes like a full-on Auntie Anne's pretzel. And I would have liked a little more salt. Because on the picture, they had a whole bunch of salt on there. And I would like it to be a little more soft. Because Auntie Anne's pretzels, 
It's known to be buttery and soft and fluffy. It has a little fluff to it. It does have a little fluff. It has that fluff, but it's just tough. Yeah. So I say, mm, would I buy this again? No. I would probably go back if I had to pick for the chocolate chip. The foot long chocolate chip cookie. But they tried. So this has been my review of the Subway foot long Auntie Anne's pretzels. If you have yet to subscribe, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. Please make sure you like, comment, share this video with each and every one you know. Thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you in the next video.